It's a political era. Societal issues are being brought to the forefront every day, from the Black Lives Matter movement, which officially began in 2013, but has been ongoing through the decades, to the persistent fight for transgender equality. We are in a time of dramatic change. And yet, the United States of America, arguably the center point of Western civilization, is yet to have a female president. Not only that, but there has only ever been one black president, Barack Obama. So in this world of increasing equality, American presidency still seems reserved for white men. Here's the big question. Would America be better with a female president? In my eyes, it's not simple. Let's start by discussing Kamala Harris, already making history by being not only the first female vice president, but also the first African-American and Asian-American vice president, a tremendous leap forward in representation. And so, it seems, she seems stands for human rights on many issues. She supports abortion rights, women's rights, and queer rights. If these are her stances, it makes sense that having her as a vice president is spectacular. And it is. But it's another topic entirely when it comes to presidency. Would having a female president be better for America? My answer, yes, but not in the way you might think. There is no guarantee that a female president would necessarily lead well, the same way there is no guarantee that an elected male will lead male. Well, that's the gamble Americans take when voting. There's no certainty. So the first female president could easily be a far-right extremist, for all we know, turning the United States into a Gilead-like republic from The Handmaid's Tale. Someone's gender certainly does not define their political stance. The reason a woman should be elected, therefore, is not as a way to introduce human rights policies, but rather as a reflection of human rights themselves. Having a woman as a president might not solve all the problems plaguing today's society, but it will show other girls that politics is an achievable goal, as Kamala Harris is already doing. The same way having a non-binary president would be good, as it would show other non-binary kids that they can shoot for the stars as well. Having a female president might not solve all of the world problems, but it will solve one, representation. Let's show everyone, not just white boys, that they can become politicians, that their voices can be heard. It's a political era, and the time for change is now.